oh man, I'm a trumpet player. So Louis is like the father of everything that we do. Personally, don't really play traditional jazz, but that's who I started listening to. I feel like in New Orleans, that's the first trumpet player you're introduced to is Louis Armstrong. So he's a very influential uh, member of what we do, and he's a very influential influence on what we do. So we play uh, New Orleans brass band music, and that's a really large genre. So we play cover songs. You might hear us play the theme of Ghostbusters, the movie. You might hear us play cover songs from like Amy Winehouse. But then we also play the traditional, such as Over in That Glory Land, I'll Fly Away, Just a Closer Walk With Thee. So it's just really basically us taking songs and putting that second line beat to it, something that somebody can dance to, accenting the upbeats, that kind of thing. So the band started in 1991 with Jeffrey Herbert, and he was a member of the Pinstripe Brass Band. So when he started, wanted to start an all-female brass band from St. Mary's Academy, he took that Pinstripe and added a female ending to it and made it the Pinettes. The first thing people say, they're surprised that we're girls and that we play brass instruments or play brass band music. It's a male-dominated industry. I mean, you don't see girls playing in the male bands. So the only girls you really see playing are the girls from the Pinettes. And it's uh, really hard because people a lot of times underestimate us and they don't believe that we're as good as the guys until they hear us. And they'll hear us and not see us like, oh, we thought that was all guys. So it's really hard just breaking that mold of being the all-female brass band, not just the girls, but the competitive band, just competing against the guys also. Thank you for inviting us. Please invite us back. We are enjoying it. We really appreciate you uh, giving us this opportunity, and we're loving it. Thank you.